y'all, welcome back to my channel. For those of you who are new, welcome to my channel. My name is Carrie Kemp and I am a model and content creator based in Charlotte, North Carolina. I have been on a mission to revamp my closet and you know, just have more options because I don't have very many options. So as you've seen in the title, this is a Shein haul. Now I want to start by saying I hate Shein as a company. Um, I think that what they've done to designers as well as the things that they've put in their clothing are just not good at all. Their business practice is just not something I personally like to invest in. However, I know that being a plus size person, we are so limited with options, especially fashion forward options and Shein has affordable fashion and I cannot deny that. Um, so I am going to show you all what Shein looks like on my body. I did buy a lot of stuff. There is everything from like jackets to sequin dresses to like fall favorites and all of everything in between. So this is going to be a lengthy one, but one you're not going to want to miss. So let's see how all of this fits. All right, so we are gonna start this off by showing you the dress that y'all seen in my stories, which is this stunning, like princess fairy-esque dress. I am in love with this dress. I got it in a size 14 because I don't have a big bust. There is no stretch in this bust. I am a 42B cup in the bust and it fits me like a glove, which I love. I find that the length is a great length on me. I am 5'6". It was only $23 as well. I will say though, that they have elastic, so you can have this off the shoulder if you want. Um, they have elastics in here, which do, it is a little bit itchy here. And the elastic down here is also uh, fairly constricting around the arms. So I will point that out just in case your arms are a little bit more sensitive. I personally don't mind it. It does have a zipper in the back as well um, and no pockets, but it does have this lining underneath, which is cute. And I love that I don't have to wear shapewear underneath it. It just, it's so cute. All right, so next we have some uh, mock necks or turtlenecks or whatever you wanna call them. I got two white ones just cause I wanted to compare them. So this one is an XL. It kind of has like a ribbed material. As you can see, it is very, very sheer. You can see right through it. Um, I just wanted something to like go underneath clothes so that I could wear a jacket. And I feel like this one is just too sheer. It is only like $7.27, like $8. So um, it's a good price point, but I think I'm gonna be returning this one just because I'll never wear it. If it's this sheer, I would rather have like mesh up here um, and wear like a sexy bra than like have it be this sheer, you know? So this one is a no for me, but for size wise, XL, is a good size on me for this. It has a lot of stretch, a lot of room. Maybe if I would have sized up to the 1X, it wouldn't have been as sheer, but because I'm wanting to tuck it in and wear it as like an undergarment, I wanted it to be a little bit tighter, which I don't feel like this is very tight. Like it's it's got some give, it's got some room, but it's just, it's a little bit too sheer for me. So let's try the other one. And same issue, this one is an extra large. I'm finding that this one is a little bit more snug than the other one. And that's something that I've heard about Shein is that the sizing is just so inconsistent. So read the reviews, but I do love the texture of this one. Like also a little bit more snug around the neck, which I like, cause then you can really layer it with necklaces and stuff. But I did purchase the turtlenecks because I have a whole look that I'm trying to create. And so I'm gonna keep this one on and I'm gonna show you guys the next piece. This was the look I was going for because the model on Shein's website had something similar and I thought she looked adorable in it. Um, so it is this dress. Again, everything will be linked down below as and what I ordered in terms of sizing. This dress was only $18. I mean, everything is just so affordable there and I understand why it's fast fashion. And, all the reasons I hate it for, I also can respect that they are actually affordable, especially in these times. So I'm just gonna go with it. 
Um, I would say, so this is a 1X and I feel like it's just a little bit too big on me. Um, just like a size. I think if I sized down, I'm going to come close so that you guys can see. Because it's nice and like it's not fitted down here, which is where my biggest part is. Um, I'm able to size it down to have like that tighter look, but I don't know. I feel like the waist comes down a little bit too low for me. I ha I do have a very high waist. I guess I could probably get it altered. I don't know, but then it would be too short. Um, overall, I think this look is adorable, but I think that it's just not me personally. I Let me try taking off this white um, long sleeve and then belting it and seeing if that gives me a different look that I'm wanting. All right, so here it is all by itself. And I actually like this look on me a lot better. I threw on just a belt that I got at H&M and took off the uh, long sleeve. And I feel like this just suits me more. I don't know why that is. Y'all, I was, when I tell you, I was so excited when I put this top on. I was so excited and then I put the pants on. Oh no, oh no. So these are a 2X and like, they don't, this is the butt area. <laughs> like I feel like maybe if I like turn them around or something, it, it, no, it it's worse. Um, overall, loving the look of it and like the colors, I would have to size up at least two on the bottom to make it worth it. I mean, the set was only $20. I love this top. I do have to wear a bra under it, but like, I think that this top is so good. And like, typically I don't even like color on the bottoms, but like, it just, it would go so well if the bottoms fit, but they just, they, they do not. So this is a hard no from me. If you are interested in this, I would highly recommend sizing up two sizes, especially if you are a little uh, bigger like me in the bottoms, cause sheesh. All right, and then we redeem ourselves with this pretty number. So this is actually a set. It is a little cropped uh, long sleeve. It goes to about here. Um, it is a 2X. I love the feeling of it. It is nice and soft. I'll come nice and close. There's no pattern or print to it. It's just a nice soft, long sleeve crop top to go under this stunner of a dress. I feel like if I threw some tights on, which I do not want to do, I am already sweating enough as is, this would be a full on look. We could also throw on a belt. I love this. So I did size up per the reviews to a 2X. It is a bodycon. I love the length of it, love the fit of it. I feel fantastic in this. Um, definitely gonna keep this one because it was only $18. So if I ever need to have a moment, this is this will be it. You guys know how I am with my bright colors is this dress. I got it in a 1X. It was a final sale, so I have to keep it. It is $8. Um, but I wish I would have sized down because it is a little bit big. I am wearing it off the shoulder. You can wear it on the shoulder. Um, just because the top is big on me, it is sliding. So I'm gonna be wearing this off the shoulder, which I'm not mad about. I think that it looks great. It does have a zipper. It's got a little bit of stretch, not a lot. Um, and the length is great. I obviously have to throw this in the dryer so that all the wrinkles come out because I don't iron. Um, but the dryer is my wrinkle remover. So there's that. The cuffs are nice and loose. So no pulling it there. The arms as well have some room in them. Overall, I'm not mad at this. All right, so next we just threw some jeans on. You guys always ask me about my jeans. American Eagle, high rise, super high rise, curvy jeggings are my go-to. I'm a size 16 in them. Um, and I just love how high-waisted they are and how stretchy they are. They're my go-tos, always. They're just consistent. They don't have a lot of options all the time, but every once in a while you can get them online. And, uh, 
that's or I like go to the outlet mall and get them at the outlet because well that's the way I like to shop anyway talking about this top you guys seen how short it is it's very very short Boop. just to there um I do wish it was a little bit longer I thought it was gonna be a little bit longer it is an XL um because I wanted it to be fitted but I did think that it was gonna be longer so that it would actually stay. I don't feel like it's gonna stay tucked in, but I did buy it just for like styling. This one I am gonna be returning. It was $8. It is a nice, light, soft fabric. Um, I also love the neck, that it's not like an, a tur an actual turtleneck. Um, it's just like loose and like up there for, for that. Because y'all were asking for shackets, so you knew that your girl had to try a shacket from Shein. Shacket from Shein. Um, love the length of this one. I am, I did purchase the 1X, and I'm not fond of the length of the arms. I feel like the arms are not long enough, but this looks so good. Like, I love the button detail on them. Um, I would not have guessed that this was $30. It is, it's so good, y'all. It is so good. Um, it does not have a second hole for the button on the bottom. I think that was a manufacturer defect because there's two holes on this side. There's only, welcome to the world of Shein. Um... Yeah, overall, loving it. It's a little bit tight in the top, in the arms, but it fits around my booty. So I'm like, are you a 1X or do I need to size up to a 2X and have it even bigger down here? I, I don't know. Sticking to plaid, I had to get this. Um, it's like a Sherpa material vest. And I love the length of it. Actually, I do wish it was a little bit longer. I wish it was as long as the jacket. But I mean, this is so freaking cute, y'all. And then it also has a lined inside, which I personally like. I did get the 1X. It does have, it actually has the one hole <laughs> if you wanted to do it up. Um, it does have some room in it. I could have sized down. This is what I'm saying. Shein is notorious for not being consistent with their, my hair is in my face. They are notorious for not being consistent with their sizing. Um, but overall, really like this. Uh, love the look of it. I think that it's perfect for fall. Throw on some tan boots and you, I'm just gonna look amazing. Now, last but not least has to be a fuzzy, pink jacket because well every year I wear my Sherpa jacket my long 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 Sherpa jacket and I always get questions about it so I figured I'd try out a new brand a new one and I'm not mad at this I wish it was longer this is a 2x so it's nice actually it fits perfectly it's not even oversized I wanted it to be a little bit baggier a little bit bigger um but overall, loving it. It is fairly warm. Again, it is lined. Um, it's $32. Great price point for that statement jacket that you're looking for. It does not have anything to close it. So it is meant to be worn open. It also does not have any pockets. Um, so that's a little bit annoying. But overall, this looks great. So we're just gonna go with it. What spoke to you? What didn't? Did I get something wrong? Sometimes I'll like watch the video after and I'll be like, you liked that Carrie? Or how come you said that you didn't like that? That looks so good on you. That's it you guys, that is all. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, overall, I, I mean, I'm sticking with my original statement of Shein um, business model not a big fan of i don't like that <sighs> i don't like a lot of the things that they do as a business however i understand that not everyone can afford high fashion clothes and so this is a great option for those pieces to make you feel fabulous because at the end of the day in my opinion you feeling your best means more than anything 
they may be my last resort if I need something in a pinch because they do have a lot of really cute options. So with all of that being said, I hope you guys have an amazing weekend. I freaking love you. Mm -hmm.